quick old business item. Uh, Citizen Jones had asked me about Rockingham County planning, mm -hmm. and I was told. No, no, Rockingham Planning Commission. Uh, it's not part of county government. Right? It's not a government. Issue. And I have, I was to meet up with uh, Bill Watson from DOT, because mm -hmm. I was told that the state mandated that they go through this, uh, and unfortunately, I wasn't able to meet up with him, so if he is on, I will see him in January, so I'll find out more about it then. So the state mandated Mr. Watson to go through this? The state mandates that they, that everybody has to go through these commissions. So the state legislature created a monopoly for the Rocky Plan. Yeah, that's something okay. you might have to talk to the state about. Working on that. I wish this were considering uh, not paying, not talking out of it. So what you're saying is true, and that would be a problem. Yeah, maybe. All right. I did just stop down and get an answer to my question. And thank you, Mr. Chairman, for being so proactive in answering it. Um, my own limited investigation on the matter confirms that our state legislature has, in fact, granted what is, in effect, a monopoly to the Rockingham Planning Commission so that, apparently, we cannot get on the... Um, list of projects that the Executive Council considers without getting the blessing of the private entity known as the Rockingham Planning Commission, a non-government entity. To get on this list, to receive government funds. So, I find that rather strange that the Sausage Factory up in Concord, known as the State Legislature, would do such a thing to us require us to uh, get blessing of a private entity in order to get federal money. Mm -hmm. It seems... Uh, what, is, what is the cost to this town to be a member of that? Like being well, you know, it, it, yeah, it's actually, you know, maybe $10 less than 12000 as they raise their dues. That's just the dues that, 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 uh, that we have to pay. There are other costs that are spread up, like the <laughs> amount of time we spend uh, or rather our town planner spends. You know, we pay our town planner, and our town planner spends considerable amount of time, so it appears, um, reacting to the needs or demands, depending on how you want to phrase it, uh, of the Rockingham Planning Commission. So there is a lot of hidden costs that, you know, the, the dues itself is like, like right there, kind of, sort of. Uh, but there are a lot of hidden costs in terms of expenses being borne by various employees in the town having to respond to the Rockingham Planning Commission, a non-government entity, making demands or requests or what have you. In addition to the demands that's placed on the citizenry, uh, you know, we're expected to run down every time they have a public hearing to tell them what we think so that they can properly ignore us and make plans accordingly. Uh, so there are a lot of expenses that are just basically hidden there. Uh, thank you for the question. It was a great question. So I just wanted to clarify that, Mr. Chairman, <clears throat> and uh, that was the only reason I came tonight.